e, prvi čekali. case study danas. Kako je čovjek čekao, sad će to biti entrance, kakav spada. Prvi case study danas kreće za koji trenutak, zahvaljujući dame i gospodo, ajde čitajmo. Marko Sikirica. Director of System Support and Integration Department, Tehno Zavod Marušić, Supervising Made Easy. Marko Hvala Sikirica. Tehno Zavod. Dobro došli Marko. Thank you, Frane. Zvale su me kolegice iz firme, možda se i družimo. <laughs> Thank you for putting more pressure on me uh, for icebreaker. <laughs> okay. Uh, we can start. Uh, welcome dear guests. Uh, my name is uh, Marko Sikirica and I am the director of the System uh, Support and Integration Department in Technozavod Marušić. Uh, we have decided not to present today uh, a specific case study. Instead, uh, we will present you our own case study uh, which can make uh, supervising easier. So, in the last 20 years, uh, from the development of uh, 3G mobile networks uh, and better fiber optics, uh, bandwidth, fiber optics bandwidth, uh, we have witnessed, witnessed the expansion of data in mobile and wired uh, networking. With new technologies like uh, 5G and 6G, this trend can be expected uh, to continue exponentially. Uh, when we are talking uh, in terms of industrial revolution and digital transformation, we are somewhere in between uh, industrial uh, uh, 3.0 and 4.0, stepping into uh, industry 4.0, uh, with connected devices and cognitive platforms, uh, with ambient intelligence uh, in between people and devices uh, in greater extent. We are starting to live in an environment with connected uh, devices in business, technical and industrial systems, increasingly vulnerability to a degree that has never been seen before. In the past, uh, organizations had separate uh, systems, IT systems, this, the pointer is lower, uh, SCADA systems <laughs> and physical security systems down there. But now uh, we can expect more and more uh, projects with IT and OT convergence. Uh, the convergence process started 50 years ago and it is expected uh, that by the year 2024 the number of connected devices in the industry will be 50%. Besides that, uh, nowadays, nowadays uh, more than 340 vendors of industry devices are competing for the market share. And also, uh, there is a new edge to cloud architecture, which bypasses the traditional five-layer stack architecture. The software has a wider range of possibilities, and it enables small and medium-sized companies to ch challenge large ones, especially to uh, software PLCs. Also, industrial connectivity protocols have emerging, encouraging that convergence. We, ent we are entering a new level of security where days of security by obscurity are over. IT and OT computing and network platforms have been converging and becoming more interconnected. There is no time and no way to turn our back to the ongoing digital transformation. It is no longer a question uh, if you will be breached, it is a question when you will be. Investors need to ask themselves if they would do something differently if uh, they knew they were going to be compromised. To get security under control, uh, you need a good architecture. But would you fly something like this? Uh, to have a good architecture, you need to think a uh, project through, from its beginning to the closure, in all its phases, design, implementation, and of course closure of the project, as well as the maintenance of the whole system. It is better to know uh, what you are missing than to think you are safe. Uh, customers and investors sometimes think that uh, if they have end of life or end of support uh, device in their systems and it's working, that they are safe, but that's wrong. 
because producers, uh, when device becomes end of sale or end of support, doesn't maintain that device and doesn't update the security uh, firmware and software. And that way, the system becomes more vulnerable and more opportunity for the hackers to hack in. Uh, I have already mentioned we are entering the world of connected devices on one side and cyber trades on the other side. With lots of data inside one system, it is easy to become overwhelmed by the sh sheer amount of information. That's why you need supervisor. Because with our help, supervi supervising is made easy. What is supervisor? It is a software solution that can replace multiple security software interfaces, multiple vendor devices, and it is fully customiz customizable to your needs. With eight years of development, 10 team of engineers and uh, developers and administrators, 44 successful installations, 30 different types of systems, more than 1,000 integrated sites and 10,000 integrated devices. We have endless possibilities. We support various security vendors in the industry, from the Honeywell, Bosch, and Chinese ones, the Hua Hikvisions, also many others. Our solution offers features like flexibility, integration, and modularity. Supervisor architecture is based on .NET framework, MSSQL, and MVC programming pattern. It is a plug-in and modular architecture, server client-based, and with REST API architectural style. We have our bootstrapper service, which takes control uh, over all other, oh, sorry, over all other services in the system connected to the main supervisor management server. And all informations are stored in the SQL there. So as I mentioned, uh, it is uh, server server client architecture with professional and enterprise version you can choose uh, with that options you are able to get distributed system and autonomous system even if uh, connection between server and the client uh, is no longer existing the distributed system can work as its own we have integrated access control system for defining rules, assign permissions, and monitor all access points using our access control module. We also integrate events and alarms with other systems like video snapshot, etc. Uh, in our video surveillance model, we have integrated multiple brands under one graphical user interface. We can control over live alarm video and playback and also interaction with GISMAP and other module systems. With intrusion model and alarm procedures, we manage escalation scenarios, and that way we are able to inform the supervisor in some control center or technical room with all alarms and procedural informations. We have also integrated perimeter protection model to be able to integrate devices uh, for aerial, ground, and under, underground protection. With our GIS uh, map, we offer visual overview that allows quicker reactions thanks to our dynamic positioning on the source of the alarm. Fire and gas management offers video verification and two-way communication protocols for early detection and fast resolving of fire and gas alarms. Visitor management module uh, controls the flow of visitors, employees, suppliers, and contractors. It is also GDPR compliant, where we have integrated ID scanners with data privacy consent. Supervisor control uh, center allows you to supervise all technical systems information in one place. That way you improve operator alertness, increase efficiency, 
takes stronger collaboration and teamwork and gets smaller total security costs. There is also a web-oriented version of supervisor, which means that we are prepared, prepared for cloud and virtualization. We always think ahead and want to go beyond security through integrating IoT devices, OT devices, physical security systems, and all other devices. Those allowing the customer to manage and supervise all events, alarms, and information easily at one place. Who can use supervisor? It can be used in banking and financial sector, power, oil, and gas industry, airports, traffic and transport, enterprise, corporate, public spaces, critical infrastructure, you name it. We can even make any other programs which are related to security and safety and integrate in our supervisor platform. If you want to see how supervisor works, please contact us and visit us on Boot 77. We are looking forward to see how we can use our experience and knowledge and to help you find ways to solve your problems. Thank you very much.